This 10th FRED video tutorial is focused on the Excel add-in feature. This powerful tool allows you to search for and download data and then create and update graphs all directly from Excel without going to the FRED website. To use the Excel add-in, you must first download it by going to the FRED homepage, clicking on Data Tools, and then Load Data from Excel. On the left side of the web page, you can choose either the Excel 2010 or the Excel 2013 version and then click Download. If you're having any difficulty installing the add-in, you can obtain detailed instructions by clicking on Installation Instructions below the Download Now button. Just below that is a link to the User's Guide which also can be downloaded as a PDF file. Once you have the Excel add-in installed, you can access it by clicking the FRED tab in Excel. The key to using the Excel add-in feature is to know the function of each of the four cells at the top left of the spreadsheet. We have highlighted each of these cells with a different color and labeled them to make clear the role of each cell. The entries in these four cells inform FRED first, which data series to recall from the FRED database, second, the units that the data should be presented in, third, the frequency of the data, and fourth, the series start date. The first cell corresponds to the series ID, which is the unique FRED identifier for each data series. If you know the series ID, you can type it directly into the cell. Alternatively, if you don't know the name, you can use any of the four data finding features on the Excel ribbon at the top of the spreadsheet. For example, let's search for the U.S. Consumer Price Index. There it is. Once you have input the series ID into the first cell, you can download the data in its default form simply by clicking Get FRED Data. Notice that the remaining three cells have been filled in automatically with the default settings for this particular series. The second cell describes the units in which the series is measured. For example, LIN means that the data is presented in levels. We can change the units from levels to percent change from year ago by clicking on the Data Manipulations tab. This converts the data from an index of the level of consumer prices in the United States to a measure of headline inflation. The final two cells indicate the frequency of the data and the series start date. Let's change the frequency from monthly to annual and let's also set the start date to 1960. To change the frequency, click the Frequency Aggregation tab, and then select Annual. We can change the series start date by typing the date directly into the fourth cell. Once you have made these changes, you can update the data in the spreadsheet simply by clicking Update Data. Let's add another series into our spreadsheet. We'll try the Consumer Price Index for Germany this time. First, let's search for the FRED data code under Browse Popular International Data. There it is. We'd like to get the two data series to be comparable, so let's specify the units, frequency, and start date to match the parameters of our first series. Then click Get FRED Data. Now that we have both data series downloaded into our Excel spreadsheet, let's build a chart showing the two series. Click on the Build Graphs tab and then Create Multiple Series Graph. Let's input the US CPI as the first series and the German CPI as the second. Under Graph Options, we can give the graph a title and we can label the axes. Let's name the graph 
inflation, United States versus Germany. And let's label the y-axis as inflation. Finally, let's edit the graph's legend under Legend Options. There's our graph. We can edit it further in the same way that we can edit any chart in Excel by clicking on the Design or Format tabs in the ribbon above. One interesting feature of the FRED Excel add-in is that any manipulation you make to the data in your spreadsheet automatically is reflected in the chart that we just made. To see this, let's change the frequency from annual to quarterly. Also, let's specify that Fred retrieved the last 12 quarters, or three years of data. Now click Update Data. As you can see, the Excel add-in is a useful tool that allows you to create a suite of charts that can be immediately updated to reflect the latest data in FRED simply by clicking Update Data.